lesbian is someone um, who is a lesbian, um, but also considered of celebrity status. <laughs> Isn't that why we're here? Is a famous lesbian. But it can also be a person who like lesbians know are a lesbian. Like your Portia de Rossi's, your Ellen Pages, your Ellen DeGeneres's. Uh, a lady who rides a horse. No? Danny, remember Danny from Tila Tequila? It's a lesbian. Who else? Tila Tequila herself might be a lesbian. I don't know, I think uh, Ellen DeGeneres is like the queen slash king so lesbian. Um, who else? She's kind of it. <laughs> a so lesbian is Portia de Rossi riding a horse. I don't know if you keep up with Tila Tequila, but I do. A lesbian is also someone who I think looks to the celestial stars for guidance. They're always saying, I'm a Capricorn or I'm an Aries, you're a lesbian. A lesbian who doesn't have sex. A lesbian is a woman who doesn't have sex, ever. Well, there are different levels of lesbian. Someone on Twitter tweet that I was her Lucy Lawless, and I was like, that's very interesting. Um, so maybe I'm a lesbian. Why not be a lesbian? I don't know, you tell me, am I a lesbian? I was convinced for a little while that when I was walking into a bar and everyone was ignoring me, it was because they were just like, didn't want to approach me because I was a lesbian, but no, nobody knows who I am. Carpet muncher is someone who enjoys eating vagina. It's someone who has sex with women via oral means. People use that term seriously all the time, and I'm like, who? Baby dykes. Baby dykes use the phrase carpet muncher regularly, and I, I walk the other way. Um, I have a cat, obviously, um, and I can't have rugs in my apartment because she eats them. She like she she chews the edges until they fray, and uh, that's a, my cat's a carpet muncher. Nobody says carpet muncher. I use the term carpet muncher more than I probably should uh, because it's hilarious and I feel so misogynistic when I use it that it's almost empowering. I think, I think friends have said that to me before, like rug muncher and whatnot, but that's like a very weird image. Uh, you rip a carpet and roll it up and it's like nasty and dusty and, and there's like tacks and glue and there's hair in it and you're like, why would I put this in my mouth? This is gross. Um, so I prefer other terminology. I'm not really sure where that came from because it, it's assuming a lot about hair, I guess. <laughs> I was called a carpet muncher. I didn't know what it meant. I was also called a muff diver. I had to Google that. Vaginas don't taste nothing like carpet. <laughs> when, and whenever I think of like carpets, I always think of Aladdin. Does that make sense? Like, oh yeah, look at that carpet muncher. Uh, normally I'll say it in a term of like endearment, like if I see a hot chick, or I'll be like, wanna munch some of that, you know, carpet, and everyone's like, oh my god, she's so funny, she's kidding around. I'm really not kidding around when I say I wanna munch some carpet. Um, I had someone correct a situation because someone was talking about scissoring, versus being a carpet muncher? You're a scissor or you're a carpet muncher? I thought scissoring was fake, so you learn something new every day.